hello everyone welcome back to another video in this video guys i'm going to show you how to fix live activities not working on your iphone and ios 16 or 17 introduced with ios 16 live activities on iphone lets you access real-time information from your favorite apps on the lock screen you can use it to keep track of live sports score flight schedule cab rides and more without opening any app Moreover, if you have an iPhone 14 Pro or later, these useful notifications are integrated into the dynamic island up top. Although it's a convenient time-saving feature, several users complain of live activities not working properly on their iPhone. So let me show you how you can fix it. So the first step is update your iPhone to the iOS 16.1 or later. Live activities for third-party apps was rolled out with iOS 16.1. If you are still using an iPhone on older version, you must update to iOS 16.1 or later. For that, you can simply go to settings, click on general, click on software update and make sure that you update your iPhone to the iOS 16.1 or later. So as I have installed iOS 17 beta. So move on to the next step, ensure that live activities are enabled on your iPhone. Even though live activities are enabled by default on all iPhone running iOS 16 or later, it's worth double checking open iPhone settings then go to face ID or passcode enter the passcode of your iPhone then scroll down and here you will see live activities if it's turned off you can toggle it turn on so once you have made sure then move on to the next step the next step is enable live activities for the app facing issue must ensure that live activities for the app in question are enabled from the settings so simply go to setting now scroll down and find your app and make sure that live activities is turned on so if it's turned off you can turn it on so once you have done this then the next step is check for network related issue everything you do on your iphone requires a stable internet connection and live activity aren't any different to ensure that everything works smoothly you must connect your iphone to the stable wi-fi or cellular data connection free from any network related issue Move on to the next step and the next step is ensure that location services for app are enabled. Some apps that support live activity may require access to your iPhone location services to work as expected. Simply go to settings then scroll down and select the app and click on location and make sure that you have given access to the location. Move on to the next step. The next step is turn on background app refresh for the app. For live activities to work on your iPhone, it's necessary that you let the app in question run in the background. You must ensure that you don't close the app from the switcher and that it has a background app refresh turned on. Simply go to settings, click on general, click on background app refresh and make sure that the background app refresh is turned on for that app. So once you have done all these steps, and if it's still not working, the last step is reset all settings for your iPhone. And this action will restore all the settings to their default value while leaving your data untouched. For that, you can go to settings. Go to general, click on transfer reset iPhone, click on reset, click on reset all settings. Enter the passcode of your iPhone and reset all settings once. So hope this video helps. Thanks for watching. Subscribe.